Hey, so welcome to another episode. So in competitive dodgeball, you have six players lined up with a foot on the back line. That's Spain down there. This is Canada down here. I'm still up, I'm still editing this game, so they're loaded. Uh, everybody has to have their foot on the line to begin with. Now, you'll see up here, this is a multi-ball sport. So you got six balls in play. Three are lined up on the center line on the right-hand side of the court that Canada's going to run for. Three are lined up on the left-hand side of the court that Spain's going to run for. You only run for the balls on your uh, side. Uh, they're going to take off this white line right here. This is called the activation line. And those balls need to come back to this side of the activation line before they can be thrown at the opposing team. So watch what they do here. They come to the center line and then they throw it back. They have a trailer. Look at this. She's receiving the ball. It is now activated. She can throw it. Those Spain players haven't even got back beyond the activation line. So they can't actually throw at her because their balls aren't activated. So what happens is she just steps into it. Boom! Take that. You can cash that at the nearest financial institution. So it's 6v5 now for Canada. But Spain's not going to just sit back and just let that happen without a response. So they come to line. They're selling pump fakes. They throw it. Ooh! 27's like, yeah, you want to cash some checks? Well, take this one. That's, oh, right there in the old uh, chest there. This guy, actually, look at this guy. He turns around. He's just like, what in the sugar plum Christmas just happened, man? He's got, got his arms open, his hands open. He's just like having an existential crisis, it looks like. You know, why the dodgeball gods betray me in my time of need? But you know what? Don't worry about him. A couple high fives and some back pats. He's going to be fine. We're moving on. Canada's coming to the line. Check this out. Oh, he throws it down in the corner. Watch this. Number five just sucks that in and catches it. So in competitive dodgeball, if you throw and hit somebody, they're out. If in this case you throw and they catch it, you're out. The person who threw it is out. And somebody from Spain is going to come back in. So that could be quite uh, a swing there player-wise. I don't understand exactly this this player right beside him, 50 whatever. She, she's wiping out there, slipping on these invisible bad up heels. I don't know where this idea of like a good defensive posture is just to sit on your butt. But if you're a player at home aspiring to competitive dodgeball, don't do that. That's just not going to work out for you very well. So anyways, we move on. Here we come. Oh, did you see that? What's awesome about this? Number five down here, he's like, hey, sauce me that ball over here. I'm like on a roll. Give me that ball. And 27 on the very far court. That's 60 feet away. He's just like that guy. He's going to take his eyes off the prize for one second. I'm going to make him pay. Look at this. Just barely misses him. That would have been uh, such an incredible hit. Oh, my goodness. So much just happened right there. Let's watch from this angle here. Good grief. You still need to slow it down. Okay, so hang out. So we've got... Canada at the line. Three players with balls. 27 on the far court. He's selling the pump fake. 25's throwing at the far corner for Spain, but he's going to do an incredible jump and avoid that. Number five down here in Spain in this corner, he's going to do a perfectly timed counter on 25. Look at this. So he gets there. Oh, double zero throws an 05 he's like i wanted that one but he throws his hands back he's like no hey your honor i didn't do it i didn't touch it nobody no jury in the world can convict me i didn't do it, it wasn't me so you know good for him oh that was just a couple seconds later oh my goodness this is classic dodgeball it happens so fast even now even now Okay, wait, I just got to back that up because so much just happened right there. So much just happened. So we've got Canada's throne. That number five, he's going to come. He's going to throw at the middle, misses her, throws back, hits number 10 on the back line. Oof, that hurt. Now in the middle, Spain throws, hits 25. Oof that hurt over here canon 27 is just like are we doing this because if we're doing this I'll, I'll yeah you can have that look at this angle you can see it right here he's like okay well there you go boom take that to the bank so everybody was cashing checks we got three players out two for canada well, one for spain now we're down to a 3v3 that's just how fast this game moves canada's coming to the line 
They're gonna like take their time. No, oh, number five and is perfectly timed pre-counter. Let's check that out from this angle. Coming up here, Canada's gonna throw fives like, oh yeah? You're not gonna see this. He's such a sneaky little player. Just kneecaps, 91. Oh, Nubble Zero throws at him, but he just kind of does this little shimmy. He's just like, yeah, I didn't touch that. And he's like, hey, 27 over here. Hey, I'm a catching machine. Throw it to me. I'm going to catch it. And 27's like, yeah, you want it? Boom. There you go. You got it. And then he's like, oh, I'm just going to duck here. That's not nothing. I'll do a little hop there. Didn't need that. All right. So now we're down to 2v2. Canada's like, I don't know. What do you think we should do? I don't know. Take, they do a little talking behind the balls, like catching up, seeing what's going on. Oh, a little pre-counter bounce. They just say, oh, you know what? Let's go. You want to take that person out? Let's take that out. Boom. It's out. Hey, what? Are you doing anything else? Right. Oh, right there just like that and it's all over little high fives back pats everybody's just like right on what's this angle look like they're like yeah let's take out this corner boom you doing anything else no let's just go for it okay there we got the high fives got the back pats teams coming out hey everybody that's great that's exactly what i would have done if it was me so thanks for watching another uh video see you in the next episode